Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. <clears throat> Excuse me. I wanted to read something to you, and I found it on a video from the American Joe Show. And, um, man, this is really weird. He His video, let me see, this is at the um, six-minute mark. Okay, I'm going to go back to the beginning, and then I'll go move forward to the six-minute mark. Okay, he talks about, he uh, showed this video of this nurse, who it was evidently her video, and he took a part of it, and he played it, and she was talking about why we don't need to wear uh, a thing on our nose and mouth, okay? Okay, so, first he was told... Hi, American Joe Show. Great news. After manually reviewing three of your videos, we've determined that they are suitable for all advertisers. Registered Nurse, this is the title of the first one, got three stars. Registered Nurse warns against wearing masks. The second one, Democrats use COVID-19 to, and then you can't read the rest. Okay. And then, not long after that, let's see, he's, all right, he gets, see, there's no date on here. He didn't say which, what the dates were, but it wasn't long after. He got a community guideline strike for the same video. It says, as you may know, our community guidelines describe which content we allow and don't allow on YouTube. Your video, Registered Nurse Warns Against Wearing Masks, was flagged to us for review. So they reviewed it manually and found it was suitable for all advertisers. Over here, somebody flagged it, and he gets a community guideline strike. See, that's all it takes. Is someone that doesn't like your show, they're jealous of your view count, or don't like what you talk about, or whatever, and they put in a, a complaint. Okay, so it was flagged to us for review. Upon review, we've determined that it violates our guidelines and we've removed it from YouTube. Now, he's, it says, we know that this might be disappointing, but it is important to us that YouTube is a safe place. Yeah, I got one of those not too long ago for a video I shared. Okay, now, I don't want to uh, let you hear all of what he's saying, so I'm just going to move to the six-minute mark. He's showing this letter from a doctor. Let me blow it up here. Whose name he goes by, Doc Graham. Apparently, this is a YouTube video, Doc Graham, G-R-A-H-A-M. Yesterday at 7.36 p.m., this man commented, or this doctor, masks, exclamation mark, folks, let a surgeon of 30 years, a.k.a. me, teach you about Masks, COVID-19, virus particle size, averages 125 nanometers, or in parentheses it says 0 0.125 microns, close parentheses. The range is... 0 0.06 microns to, one point to 0.14 microns. 
one needs an electron microscope to see a COVID-19 virus particle. The hoarded N95 mask filters down to 0 0.3 microns. So, N95 masks block few, if any, Viron, vir, virons or virus particles. <laughs> this is a simple fact, so you just cannot argue against it. Other surgical masks, homemade masks, and kerchiefs do the following. One, Allow free passage both ways in and out of COVID-19 virons. I think that's how you say that. It's V-I-R-I-O-N-S. Two, they become a warm, damp, or moist reservoir of COVID-19 particles in asymptomatic carriers. So you've been tested. They say you have it. So you're a carrier, but you don't you don't have symptoms. Uh, let me go on. Here it says it in parentheses, estimated to be eighty five percent of all people tested. Close parentheses. For surgeons, years of training, intimidation, and humiliation teach us to touch nothing but our surgical field. For surgeons, years of training, intimidation, and humiliation teach us to touch nothing but our surgical field. Yeah. Once you scrub, I was a scrub nurse for a while. That's what I was doing when I got sick. You don't touch anything below your waist. You can't turn your back to the surgical field or you. it is said to be contaminated because even though you've put a sterile gown on, the back of you is to the non-sterile air it's kind of ridiculous actually how far they take it in surgery but you can't turn around uh, you just don't touch anything but the sterile stuff all right you don't touch anything but the surgical field lay people constantly touch rearrange and manipulate their masks quote unquote masks wonderfully inoculating thousands of virus particles onto their bare or even worse gloved hands i don't know why that would be any worse whichever way it is you're going to go around touching stuff after you've touched a mask that you've breathed into and other people have breathed into from the other side that are around you. Do you understand what these, this doctor is saying? So, these absurd masks encourage the fomite transmission and in parentheses he put quote infected unquote Articles dash to let's see articles to hand to face <laughs> infected articles to hand to face like you've touched something say uh, a guardrail and you're walking along and then you 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 mess with your mask it's coming off and so. You'd straighten up your mask and your hands are dirty. They don't look dirty. They don't smell dirty. They don't appear dirty. But they've been touching stuff as you walk along. 
So now you've touched your mask. Or if you're not wearing a mask and you touch your face, it's the same thing, I guess. Except, I don't know. You're not supposed to touch your face when anything's going on. Uh, hand to face transmission of the virus. So go ahead and allow idiots to delude and mislead you to the false sense of security and danger of masks. Okay. We had a thing about this today. We talked a bunch of some of us were outside. Not a bunch, just a few. Talking about masks. I didn't have one on. Everybody else did. And three of the people were from the second floor, which up until May 1st were not allowed. To, we were not allowed to associate with them. They were not allowed to associate with us. We couldn't even sit in their lobby. If one was in the lobby, no one else could sit in the lobby from upstairs. Fourth floor up is we're, we're called independent living. The, the rules were ridiculous to me. Okay, it's time to finish up. I got to hurry up. Okay, I should have snoozed it. I'm probably going to forget. Anyway, so I wanted to share this with you. That it... I found out that we have one case here now. One. And four employees tested positive. So they were sent home. Okay, now that floor, the third floor, is skilled nursing, like a nursing home. Okay, that we're not allowed to go on. None of us are allowed to step off the elevator onto the third floor. And the elevator that's at the end of the hall that we can use is blocked. We can, It's locked off to us to use. Okay, so anyway... I was telling this other lady about how the masks were causing us to breathe in our own carbon dioxide and not get in enough oxygen. And she was arguing back that because she still works, her husband's ill. Anyway, it's a long story, but she works in a medical field. And she said, I have to wear it if my husband were to catch it, he, he would he would die. He wouldn't be able to go. Yeah, I said, well, I said, it is kind of like a flu. I said, he wouldn't, he wouldn't even want to get the flu. Anyway, people don't want to hear what I know. They just think I make stuff up, I think. But I'm going to end this here because it's getting late. And um, I just wanted to share this with you that um, if any... Any of you are still real, you know, probably you aren't. Um, and I don't know if you share this with anybody, if they're going to believe it. But that is a surgeon of 30 years. And I've heard other people say it. And YouTube, you can't dispute it. I mean, you can. You can do anything you want because it's your business. But honestly... It's the truth. And it's on a, uh, the video. It's called The Truth Hurts. Dash. Watch and share before this video is removed. So I would suggest you watch it and share it. His video. Share his video. Uh, American Joe Show. And, um, well, you can share mine too. And they'll get to it. Because... I live in a place like they're talking about and I the people outside three of them were saying that were from the second floor I started to say they started letting them go out to the patio May 1st I think it was the first it could have been the fifth anyways whenever it was some of the states were let you know, easing up um but the man that runs second floor got them all masks 
and they're just two thin layers of cotton like he's talking about perfectly useless he gave them all one and said they had to wear them if they leave their room you know he, he doesn't know any better he's not an RN but he's running second floor assisted living anyway uh I guess he's got a degree in business or something, but it, you know, you don't, you, you, nursing service handles the nurses part, but anyway, I'm, I'm getting sleepy, so I'm going to go before I say something stupid, <laughs> if I haven't already, uh, well, you know, you think it's over and it's not over, I mean, how they don't want to hear uh, well how do you know that lady asked me I said something about the mask out there on, sec on the patio I said the masks are doing nothing but hurting you because you're breathing in your own carbon dioxide and you're not breathing in enough oxygen well how do you know that <laughs> if you tell them I I watch YouTube. <laughs> it sounds stupid, doesn't it? People have no respect for YouTube if they are not connected. They think it's a bunch of people who know nothing about anything, just getting on, wanting to make a video about their self or something they think they know about and they don't know any more about it than the man in the moon and because mainstream media didn't tell them that. It's not true. And I want to just... Uh, listen already. Wouldn't want to punch the person. It's just the feeling of... How do I get through to you? I, you know, if I could think faster I could say because I read a report from a surgeon of 30 years now I can say that I can say that now but anyway I'm going to let you go I'll talk to you later bye for now uh, enjoy the video if you want to alright the link will be in the description box not attached to this video okay Bye-bye. Talk to you later.